You love Jamaica? Yeah. But everybody in Jamaica is from Africa. Yes. But if you tell some of them they're African, they get upset. Ah. They, their brain they think, has... They think they are, they are a white man? I don't know. Yeah, but they have black color. They have black. Anybody from this, <laughs> right, is from here. Yeah. Right? It's and, from Africa. Right. And I'm from one of the islands in the Caribbean. Ah. And, well, you know the story. People were taken from here, brought to the Caribbean, the Caribbean colonies, you know, slave colonies. Yes, yeah. And when slavery was over, you're still in the colony. Yeah. So my parents born me, and then they say, okay, let's go to England to get educated. And, you know, I get educated, learn how to do video, do, how, do different things. Okay. And now I return back to Africa, the closest I could get to my homeland. This yeah. is Sierra Leone. Yeah. And this is the closest I could get. I don't know which part my great my ancestors were taken from. Okay. So I know this land itself, the continent. I am here. Yeah. And I, this closest I could get. So I'm very pleased. Let me shake your hands okay. as a ceremony, yeah. as a brother. No You're born here. Yeah. Okay. I'm very pleased. Okay. Okay. Now I'm gonna go up there and I'm gonna do a little bit of um, Martin Luther King kind of thing. Okay. Right. D t tell me. Tell me about this building. This building is for the slaves. How okay. they kept the slaves. Yeah, here's the, the door where they put them. Alright. Yeah, the door is over there. Okay, so they, they came out the door. Yes, yeah, the, the, the white people live on top of this. Okay. They live down the slaves. Alright, let me sit here. Here I am in Sierra Leone. This building behind me, I am told, is where the slaves were kept before they were taken to put on the ships. To be exported to the Caribbean. I've returned here to say I am free at last, free at last. Thank God I'm free at last. I am back in the land of my ancestors who were brutally and murderously taken from this continent to work in the, co to work in the colonies of the Caribbean. Jamaica, Grenada, Trinidad, Tobago, all the islands of the the, the, the Caribbean, the ones who speak English belongs to Britain, the Spanish one belongs to Spain, the French one belongs to, to France. These are all colonies where they took people here from the land of Africa to work in the colonies. We made those countries great, big, rich. Africa now is crying. Africa now needs help. Like Bob Marley says, no woman, no cry. It's time we stop the women crying here in Africa because of poverty, because of deprivation. All of you who live in England, all of you who live in America, who is of this color, you're born, your ancestors is of here in Africa. I am asking you to come help the country, help the people, right? You don't have to come and live here. Just come and visit. Help a little bit of the economy. Help our brothers, help our sisters. Right, be a little bit richer, be able to do what they want to do, help to compete with the same world in America and Britain which you're living in. But remember what you have forgotten you're born of a slave, you're still a slave, your mind is still not your own. If I ask you your name, you will give me an English name, it is not an African name. If I ask you what you speak, you would say only English or American. That is not your language. You have been brainwashed. Like, the, like that movie Total Recall, you need to be reprogrammed again because they've been totally and utterly wiped. Not only your mind, but wiped your culture from you. So if you're watching this, come to Africa, any part of Africa. I am here in Sierra Leone. I hope to retire here in Sierra Leone. I hope to help, I hope to help the people here in Sierra Leone and you come visit anytime or if you if you have that way inclined come and stay and help the economy help the people like Bob Marley says like my friend here no woman no cry we have to stop the women crying we have to stop the children crying we have to stop the poverty we can do it you are skilled so come over and help the people I'm tired of Africa being a victim of charitable donation starvation spreading across the nation. It's an understated complication. It does not discriminate by geographical section.
your life is it good well the life is not good because things are hard okay T- tell me a little bit about the life how 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 is our things daily well still there is no business okay we don't have market okay we don't have shop if you want anything to buy unless you go to the town yeah Okay. T- tell us a little bit about King Masco. What would do you know him from before? What what's he doing? I know King Masco. One of the family mix. From the beginning. King Masco was born at Estin village. Okay. He grew up here. He attended the primary school and further secondary school education. Okay. From here, he go Take over to America. We are stay. No, don't wave your hands. Yeah. Um. Yes. Yeah, so, uh, okay. And he's he's gone abroad and he's come back now. Yeah. What 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 do you, what do you think about that? Well, hey, he, he, he has come back. We don't know what you want to come and do here because okay. want institutes. We need factories. We need the young girls and young boys to work okay. because we are all sitting down doing nothing. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, what, what's your message now to, let's say, the rest, the rest of the world, and to um, Hastings? Well, the mm. message I want to send mm. in America, mm. want the American people to help us, okay. so that we can be employed. Mm-hmm. So when we are working, we will, life will be better for us. Yeah. <laughs> hello to the world. <laughs> Just say this is Hastings. Saying hello. Hi, this is Sarah Leon. Hi, Sarah Leon Hastings saying hello to the world. Okay, one, two, three. Sarah Leon Hastings saying hello to the world. 